Can you turn your head to the side there for me? The other way, good. And I'm just going to touch different parts of your head and scalp you. Tell me, is there any pain or discomfort as I do that? No. Good. Can you turn your head this way? Just want to look a little closer, look at your scalp here. See if there's any. And lend your head forward. Good. And that way. Just checking to see if there's any scalp skin problems. And I don't see that. Good. And then I'm going to have you just look up towards the ceiling. I'm going to pull your eyelids down here. Good. Okay, and that looks fine. Let me just shine the light at your eyes and see how your pupils constrict. Good. Look down. Look all the way across. Up. Down. Good. And then I'm going to have you look in. Good. That's all fine. Forehead. Okay. Forehead. Cheek. 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 Good. Chin. Chin. Good. Okay. You can go ahead and open your eyes. That was all, all fine. <laughs> Good. Okay. Uh, most patients usually like that part of the examination. Uh, the next thing I want to do is uh, start to examine uh, some of the, the neck and shoulders. So you know what? Let's have you, uh, if you can lower your gown um, in front here. Uh, okay. Um, first of all, can you touch your chin to your chest? Good. Then go straight back. Good. Then touch your chin to your shoulder. Good. Then your chin the other way. Good. And next I want you to kind of tilt your head towards one shoulder and then the other side. Good. Okay. And just want to examine different parts of your shoulder here too. Good. Okay. You can take your arms and just go straight out and over your head. Okay. Now put your arms your hands behind your head, good. Then I want you to kind of um, touch back behind your, I just want to see how far up you can get your thumbs. Good, okay, that's normal. You can go ahead and put, put your arms back in your gown. Good. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing in the other eye. Just come over to the other side here. And again, just stare straight across at the wall. Good. Okay, and that looks completely normal. There's no wax or any sign of infection. The same thing here, I'm going to look at, just pull your ear back and take a good look at that. Good, both your eardrums look completely normal. Okay, and the same thing here. Good, and that all looks normal. Can you punch your shoulders up just a little bit? Okay, I'm just gonna under your chin here. Good. I'm just going to feel for the glands in the very back of the head here, too. Good. And there doesn't seem to be any uh, swollen glands at all. Next thing I want to do is just feel for your windpipe or your trachea that it's in the middle here. And it is, and it moves freely. Good. So. 
And another one. Good, and everything seems to move symmetrically. I'm just going to put my hands around the bottom of your chest here now. Just breathe in and out again. Just breathe normally. Again. Whoops. You know, actually, can we, can we pull this down in front here, too? Mm -hmm. Okay. Make it a little bit easier. Good. And I'm just going to percuss in front. You can put your arms at your sides. Good. Great. Okay. I'm going to come around, listen in front, you can relax your, your arms. Good. And your lungs sound, sound completely normal. You could lay flat for me and pull the ledge out for your feet. You can just do that, that'd be fine. I also need to get... Um, well, my, one other straight edge here, so let me just grab something from the desk. If you could turn your head to just to the left just a little bit, John. I'm looking uh, at the neck veins, uh, which are a sign of your uh, hydration or your volume status. I'm looking for a pulsation. I'm going to put one of the rulers here uh, on your chest. I'm going to put the other ruler to where I see the pulsation. And actually... Uh, good. The actual pulsation would be make a line under zero, which is uh, normal. So your volume status would be normal. So I'm just going to put this down. Or for many of the chambers of the heart, they're pumping too vigorously. Good. Okay. And now I'm going to listen just to your heart. Good. Just a little bit higher there. Good. And put your arms at your sides. Okay. The first thing I want to do is take a listen to the, the bowel sounds in the abdomen. Sounds fine. You let me know if there's any pain or discomfort. All right. Is there any pain? No. No? Down low here? No. Here? Okay. Good. 
Good. Okay, I'm going to start from the boat here, too. Ask you to take a deep breath for me. Good. Exhale. Another deep breath. Exhale. And one more. Good. And I don't feel your spleen tip, and that's normal. I'm going to kind of press somewhat firmly and ask you to take a deep breath. And exhale. And one more time. Good. And I don't feel your kidney on that side. Do the same thing over here. Again. Good. And I don't feel your um, kidneys, and that's, that's normal. We usually don't feel them in adults. I ask you to take a deep breath. Exhale. Another deep breath. Exhale. And one more deep breath. Good. And I don't feel your spleen tip. So go ahead and lay flat. So let me just move. The, um, the gown a little bit here. Okay. I'm just going to palpate first of all for the pulse here in the groin, the femoral pulse. Good, and that's normal. And I'm just going to listen to the blood flow in that pulse here too. Okay. Good. It's a normal sound. Just want to feel in this area too if there's any swollen glands in the groin. Okay, and that's there are none. I'm going to go to the other side here and, and feel for the pulse here too. Good. Good. Good, and I don't feel any swollen lymph nodes in the uh, groin and the inguinal area, and the pulses uh, are normal down in the groin, too. Now I want to check some of the um, range of motion uh, of your legs. I'm just going to gather the, the sheet there between your legs there. And just have you bend your ankle back and forth and invert it and invert it. Good, now I'm going to bend your knee here and then rotate it. Good. Do the same thing with the other uh, foot here. Give you a lift up, down, out, in, bend your knee, and then bend at the hip here. Rotate in, rotate out. Good. Push out against me. Good. Now it. pull in. Good. Have you lift up your leg here? Don't let me push it down. Hold it up real strong. Good. Put it down. <laughs> and then the other leg here, let's do that here too. Lift up, hold it real strong. Good, nice strong pulse. Good, so our muscle strength. So again, all the, the strength in the muscles is, is normal there too. Left, right, right, left, left, right. Good, and I'm gonna just run the cotton up your leg. Does that feel the same as we go from foot towards? Yes. Okay, and the same thing on the other side. Does that feel equal? Yes. Good. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing on your hands. You just have to put your arms there. And just say which side you feel me touch you with the cotton. Right. Good. Left. Left. Right. Right. Left. Good, and that's all normal. All right. 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 Left. 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 Right. Right. Good. The same thing now would do your hands. If you want to put your palms up, let's try that here. Right, left, left. Okay, palms down. Left, 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 right, right, right. Good. So that's all normal. You can open up your eyes. Next thing I want to do is check for your sense of position. I'm just going to grab your um, finger here, John. I'm either going to lift your uh, finger up down, and I want you to tell me which way you feel it move, okay? Okay. Close your eyes. 
down, down, up, up. Good. The same thing in the other hand here. Down, down, up, up. Good. Now I'm going to do the same thing in your big toe on both sides. Again, this will be up and that will be down, okay? Up, up, down, down. Good. And the, the other foot here. Down, down, up, down. Good. Okay. You feel yes. that? Okay, tell me when it goes away. Good. Same thing over here. You feel that? Yes. Okay, then tell me when it goes away. Is it gone? Uh, yeah, I guess okay. there's pressure on there. Okay. Well, you know, let's try it again. If you're not sure, let me, maybe I move off the knuckle. Do you feel that? Yes. And Zayf, tell me when it goes away. Yes. Okay, uh, good. All right, now we're going to do it on the ankle, too. Do you feel that, pre that vibration? Okay, now tell me when it goes away. Yeah, it got went away. Okay, and the same thing over here. You feel that? Yes. Tell me when it goes away. Went away. Good, okay. I'm going to tickle the bottom of your toes here now. Um, uh, it might seem a little uncomfortable, but again, that's not my purpose to make it uncomfortable. <laughs> okay. Good, okay, and the same thing over here. Good. Okay. Next, I want to just check something else here in your ankle. I'm just going to kind of move your foot forward. Good. And same thing over here. Good. Okay. Just kind of bend your knee just a little bit like that. Okay. Come around. Bend it just a little bit. Good. Okay. I'm going to check your reflexes in your arms here, too. Just like that. I'm going to check your biceps. Your biceps over here. Okay. And then you can check your triceps reflex. You can put your arm, just let it relax and lay limp. Okay. Same thing here. Just kind of let your arm hang limp. Good. Okay. Put uh, your heel here on top of your knee and just kind of slide it down your shin. And a nice smooth movement. Great. Now do the other side for me too. Slide it straight down your shin. Good. Okay. Why don't you go ahead and sit up. Let me just take this sheet out from uh, your legs. You, know, you can um, uh, go ahead and, and stand up over there for me. You know, let me tie the gown up for you here and back. So the next thing I want to do is I want to check uh, some movement with your back as well as check um, uh, some other uh, walking. So what I have you do, John, lean forward and touch your toes. Okay, then straight up. Now can you kind of arch your back and go backwards? Good, okay. Now with your arms at your side, I just want you to kind of go to the one side and the other side. Good, and that's all normal. Let me tie up your, your gown a little bit better here. I'm going to have you walk across the room now. You go ahead and walk to the wall and turn around. And just walk normally towards this wall. Good, okay, turn around. I'm going to have you put, like you're walking a tightrope, one foot uh, in front of the other, heel to shin. Okay, turn around and do that again for me. Uh, so, thank you for... Thank you.